and welcome back to my channel. I'm Ginny Mae and today I would love to talk to you about accepting responsibility. Accepting responsibility is like putting yourself up to the next level. For example, maybe you've had a mom or a role model or a teacher that has said to you, you know what, why don't you just grow up? Why don't you just step it up a notch? And I know when you are the receiver at that point, it's really hard to understand what does that actually mean. But a lot of times it means, you know what, take accountability of your own actions and start accepting your own responsibility. This is the one of the main ways that you can end up promoting yourself to the next level. Keeping an open mind also to accepting failures and remembering that making mistakes is one of the number one ways that we learn in life and are able to get better. You've all heard the stories of someone that's extremely successful actually has a lot of mistakes in their back pocket that they have made and they have learned from. So we should all be a little bit more open to be making these mistakes and remember that we're living, we're loving, we're growing, and this is the way that we are end up going to be learning the best. It's always easy to find somebody to either take the credit when something's going well. For example, oh, who did this? This is magnificent. I was, yay, it was me, even though it wasn't so much me. But on the other hand, it's really hard to find someone to take the blame when something went wrong. And if you think about it, at a very young age, we all started to be incredibly good at putting the blame on somebody else. For example, if your mom was inside and she's mopping the floors while you and your little brother are outside playing in the mud or wherever it is, and your mom is still mopping the floors and when she is done, she opens the windows, she goes into the next room, has a cup of tea, and during that time, you and your brother tear through that room and put footprints all over. When your mom finds out, she comes to the room, she's like, ah, oh my gosh, I just spent all this time cleaning the floor. And then when she sees you and your brother, she's gonna ask the big question, who did this? What's the answer? Of course the answer is he did it. He did it, I didn't do it, or I did it because everybody was doing it, or I didn't do it because nobody else was doing it. And we started to become masters at figuring out how we can put the responsibility on somebody else. Because if we can do that, then we're actually free. Then we didn't do it. But you know what? As we grow up, we find out even though we did something that wasn't so nice and we could possibly cover it up, you know what? I still would go to bed thinking in my heart, you know what? I don't feel so good because I know deep inside it was my fault. And that's not a good feeling to have at all. So be big and brave and get the big shoes on and stand up for your responsibility. There's a saying that I love that says, when you mess up, you need to fess up. And I think that's one of the best ways to make you feel better and also have this idea that you know what, you are learning, you are growing, and you are going to make mistakes. Remember to deeply apologize for whatever mistakes that you made, any promises that you have broken, and that's the best thing that you can do and then move on. We are alone responsible for our own actions. So the sooner that we're able to realize this and put this into our daily routines and our thoughts of how we're kind of living and growing and growing through life, uh, the better it's going to be not only for yourself, but also for others. So I hope you really focus on yourself to think about what type of situations I am that I'm really not accepting responsibility and how can I bump myself up to the next level to be a bigger person. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you do, please give a like below and subscribe. I hope you also watch some of my other videos to give some tips and tricks on service. And I will see you next week during Waiters Weekend, which is Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. And I hope that you have a wonderful week. Let's go out there and give some amazing service. I'm Ginny Mae, the Intergalactic Supreme Goddess of Guest Service. And if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel by pressing my face right here. Otherwise, if you'd like to see another video, just press here. I thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.